We're out of the party now. Oh. Do it. You ready? Do it. I'm too Goodbye, old. Goodbye, my friend. I've just uh, sent a request to Funmiki5 to execute me because I want to be put off my, <laughs> out of my misery. I get this vomit feeling when I'm joining a server. I cannot do it anymore. <laughs> I've uh, looted 285 helis in one life. I killed 60 players. I've been alive for 54 days. Uh, and some people might think, Pinton, you're trolling us. No one can loot 285 helis in one life. So yeah, I have done it. Trust me. I've got three 30 round 7.62 magazines for my G3. Uh, yeah, I'm, uh, I have to abort. I haven't found a single ghillie piece. That's amazing. I found two pieces in 58 crashes in my ghillie video. And now I've do, done 285 crashes and I haven't found a single ghillie piece. Yeah, but uh, I found this really cool magazine. You see, this is a custom skin made of uh, by Gusmanek, and it's the 556. Yeah, it's true. And if you stick around until the end, you'll see what gun I also found. So let's get going. Yeah, I was trying to be friendly that this guy should get his loot back, but then uh, I was suspicious because he, he was in a squad. So then I suddenly heard footsteps and I realized this fucker sent his squad on me, so I, I wiped that squad. I'm just gonna show how I'm doing it, so maybe it will help someone. So, I first jump up here, you check this corner over here, no, there's no smoke, there's no heli here. Then we run like a bit right to 30 degrees. Yeah, here's a heli, you see it. So we just checked three heli spawn uh, places. And one of them had a heli. And here I actually ran into PvP. 
over here but here you can see there are zombies this one is unlooted so you have to check for um, uh, this place other players might come running from here other players doing the server hop you know so I like to loot this hell is really quick because this is a high oh that one I yeah so here you can get uh, like the black gas mask with uh, green eyes or red eyes or black eyes so there are three different gas masks here and you have to empty the crates empty all the crates otherwise the heli crash won't despawn so when you're doing this a couple of hours you will run into your old looted heli crashes and you have to be careful here because um, you can get ran up to okay we're done Yeah, so this guy, he got his loot back. And before I log off, I just check around a bit, so no one is trying to pop shot me, so I accidentally combat log. Okay. Yeah, we got him. So you guys might have noticed that I'm two-tapping these zombies. So you might be asking yourself, Pinton, what sort of melee are you, <laughs> are you rocking? Oh, this guy. Oh, he had... Uh, he bought those clothing. It's, it's cosmetics that he bought. Yeah, but anyhow, I'm rocking the combat knife and then I have the sharpening stone. So that... Uh, makes it a two tap it's really awesome it's one of the best uh, melee combinations i think yeah and this is how it looks when there is a heli crash there you see that smoke that's what i'm looking for and the way to approach this i think is to run up here and you have to be careful people can pop up here with, at the ladder Yeah, this was a server hop that's been here, and he, he forgot to uh, empty that little uh, that little ammo box made so th this heli didn't despawn. Ooh, I think it's a duo.
and a good way to you know if you know that there could be a player in the area let's say um, you're usually spawned in here but if you spawn in over there or up here then there is a player around here so when I get pushed let's say I, get, I spawn in there then I know there's a player here then I usually I like run a bit and then I sit like this and just watching for movement it's really powerful Oh, we're lucky. It's a dual heli-crash, this server. So we had one at the beach, and now we have one at the this spot. That's nice. Yeah, this is why you have headphones. I heard that guy made his tiny, tiny little uh, footstep. So, otherwise he probably would have killed me. I can tell immediately that this guy is a total sweat. He got this purple um, hustler cosmetics, and uh, yeah, he ain't gonna ruin my. Uh, you ain't gonna ruin my kill streak, bro. You ain't gonna ruin it. So that that's why I, I play so super careful.
yeah, so you might notice that I pull back a bit. That's because I, with the G3 it's better than 5.56. I want range. I want to have my opponent at a distance because that gives me all the benefits because I don't think he has like a 30 round 7.62. And this guy, he's also a sweat. Notice how he is, begins to stalk me. I've just uh, pop shot at him and he's still calm and begins to stalk me. So this guy was a sweat. You're out of the party now. Oh. Do it. You ready? Do it! I'm too Goodbye, old. Goodbye, my friend. <laughs> no, Pitten. Ah, uh, finally I'm free. <laughs> oh my dude, you're geared. Yeah, for sure, man. Oh. What the heck? <laughs> you live for how many days? Oh, uh, 53 days. My goodness. 60 kills. All right. So, where does this uh, magazine belong? <laughs> it belongs to the fucking operator. Yeah, I'm rocking like the... This is the Ferro Concept sling with a quick adjust. It's a US product. And this is the short foregrip. So I obviously didn't find this in a heli crash. I found it uh, in a gun store because I'm a hunter. And they recently changed the gun laws in Sweden. So you can buy this uh, sort of cool guns to hunt. So, and I also created a Discord. So I'm gonna play with some fans and uh, maybe do some events and stuff. So I put that link below. It would be awesome if you joined it. And also I would like to get 1000 subscribers because then I can uh, monetize my channel. And uh, I didn't find any ghillie piece in this video, uh, even though I went to 285 crash sites. So I'm looking for the for the top and the pants. It's for my son. It's this this uh, this cool fella. So uh, if you're like already got those pods and you're hopping and you find them, you can send me a a DM if you want to help help out. Uh, and also, if you think that I'm like a leftist snowflake having this pin supporting the Palestinian people, um, I could have like a 12 hour rant about uh, things in this area. Uh, these, they have been genocided since 1948. And uh, some of you might be Christian and Americans. And I say that uh, all of the Christians, you should m watch a documentary called Marching to Zion, what uh, these people think about Jesus. And also, if you think that they're the, your greatest ally, you should uh, Google the USS Liberty incident where Israelis, uh, they killed 34 American sailors. And there has been uh, declassified radio communications that they, they knew that it was an American ship and they did it anyway. It was a false flag operation. And if you want to go really deep into the rabbit hole, I recommend you the documentary called Missing Links. You can find it on like Odyssey and BitChute. Uh, yeah, it's uh, really deep into the rabbit hole. Uh, it's about 9-11. Yeah. Yeah, 9-11 and Israel. And if I was American and watched that documentary, I would be so, so mad. So the <laughs> these guys are not your allies. If you think so, you're very naive. Describe them saying, quote, Evidence linking these Israelis to 911 is classified. I cannot tell you about evidence that has been gathered. It's classified information. Quote, stated they served in military intelligence, electronic surveillance intercept, and or explosive ordnance units. Explosive ordnance units. Explosive ordnance units.